<clears throat> so as I said, Valley of <clears throat> the Artists is uh, something remarkable in the West Bank of Thebes because firstly, when we know that there are four different categories of tombs in the West Bank and that shows us uh, very clearly that there are four different categories which were very highly appreciated in the ancient Egyptian time. This is why we still can see their tombs at the moment. Okay, yeah. And maybe we are not surprised when we say the kings, the queens, the nobles, but we are surprised to see the tombs of the workers or the tombs of the artisans, the artists. Mm. But that means that art, education, crafts, were very highly appreciated in the ancient, ancient Egyptian, Egyptian time. Yeah. So this is why they were very highly uh, 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 appreciated and, and, and they had a village which we still can see today. Maybe this is the remarkable thing as well because it's the only village we can see from the ancient Egyptian time. The reason is that houses in the ancient Egyptian time were not that important like the tombs or the temples. This is why they were built usually out of mud brick. Mm -hmm. So this is why we can't see any houses. But here we can see it's not just a house, it's a village. It's the village of the artist. And as I said, <clears throat> the village is about 3,600 years old, which is the same age of wow. Valley of the Kings. Yeah. Because when uh, Tutmos the first decided digging his tomb there of course he started gathering the the royal artists and i told you before the tomb had to be a top secret in valley of the kings so also the the the, the artists had to hide somewhere mm -hmm. and this is why there was an exception for the artists to live in the west bank because they never lived in the west bank of the nile this is the city of the dead they uh, uh, had to live in a place similar to Valley of the Kings. So if we look, we can see a valley and we can see that this hill used to hide the workers yeah. and even to hide their movement to Valley of the Kings because they had their own track from here to Valley of the Kings, which took about uh, uh, an, hour. an hour and a half to get to Valley of the Kings twice a day going and coming back. Hour and a half there and back or an hour single way? Going there, single and way, coming, yeah. and then after they finished, their shift was about eight hours of work. Yeah. They came back. They worked eight days a week. Hmm? Wow. Yeah. Eight days a week, so yeah. no, no rest. Uh, no, they had two days weekends. Because week in the ancient Egyptian time was ten days. Oh, I see. The month was divided into three weeks. Okay? okay. They, had, they had the rest uh, two days a week. Okay. So six days a month, they worked. <sighs> Uh, 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 their days for the, uh, the, the, the kings, for the uh, uh, pharaohs, and in, in their six days rest, they could work in their own tombs mm -hmm. or they could work for private clients. The, the, uh, the, the uh, salaries or the wages were given to them uh, like food. So meat, fish, uh, beans and things like that yeah. and they were provided with these twice a month okay. every 15 days these things used to come here and we can imagine that every day in the morning before they went to work there were two queues here of two sixties two chiefs of workers two assistants and they started giving them the tools after sharpening them giving them candles giving them everything like food and so on and then they started walking to Valley of the Kings while nobody could see from the east side yeah. then they started working over, over there and they came back sometimes they stayed more like they stayed the whole week in the site in the working site in Valley of the Kings and that maybe happened in the 70 days when they were in a rush when they, they were only when the 70 Pharaoh days died. yeah so they stayed more and this is why we could know that of course they could read and write yeah. ancient Egyptian language their wives could also read and write because here we found many of the letters which were sent from the artists to their wives 
oh, I see. to ask about their children and so on. Mm -hmm. One of the interesting things... These are things, on papyrus? Hmm? Letters were... No. Letters usually were in, in something called ostraca, which is this. Okay. Which is like buttery. We found okay. thousands of them in here. Taban, they were bigger than this. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. And uh, 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 very interesting thing we found.